it's time to get to work. Let's get to it. This is episode two in this M8 Bagger project for we have not named yet or come up with a name for this series or any of that shit yet, but we are building the 21 Road Glide that we got from House of Harley out of Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Uh, we just did a review video, did all that stuff. She's super dope to ride. Love it a lot. Today, I'm gonna start tearing this thing apart. I really don't wanna tear this bike down because it's a really fucking nice motorcycle and it's only got 40 miles on it. But that's life. I got shelves of shit over there, boxes of shit over there, stuff that needs to go on this bike. We're just gonna get as much done today as possible. It's a whole bunch of brand new stuff. Rear fender's coming off, exhaust is coming off, the whole entire front end is coming off. Uh, the only thing that we're actually using from the front end is the switch housings and the gauges. That's it, everything else is going. Uh, the wheel, we're gonna use the front wheel for now until I can afford to have a set of our wheels made. Uh, gonna leave the antenna, probably run a raccoon tail on the back of it, it's awesome. That's it, I'm gonna start tearing things down. I fucking don't know what I'm gonna start with, honestly. I can do the whole front end, except for the gauges. I don't have anywhere to mount the gauges, and you just sons of bitches won't run without the gauges hooked up, which I would prefer to run no gauges. If I can figure out how to run no gauges on this, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna start ripping shit apart, dude, to see where it goes, I guess. Movie trivia for you guys. Actually, not trivia. It's another. Ryan Cruzy movie tips or movie that you should watch on the Ryan Cruzy movie list. They Live, starring Rowdy Roddy Piper. One of the greatest fight scenes ever in a movie. Rowdy Roddy Piper and some dude that was on Night Court, if you remember Night Court back in the day. But they duke it out in this alleyway. They Live, great movie. Guy finds a pair of sunglasses in a box and he puts them on and you can see the aliens that are posing as humans. Fucking goes on a killing spree. I'm here for two things. Chew bubblegum and kick ass. And I am fresh out of fucking bubblegum, brother. Rowdy Roddy Piper is one of the greats. I think he's dead. Does anybody know is Rowdy Roddy Piper still alive? Is he dead? Yeah. Motherfucker. That motherfucking Ronda Rousey walking around being Rowdy. She totally took over his spot. Which honestly, if somebody's going to do it, I guess it should be her. Yeah, I can respect that. I was going to start talking shit on her for doing it. But now that I think about it, you know what? Honor the greats. That's, that's fucking... I, 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 I'm loving it. She said something that stuck with me a long time ago. A fucking DMB. Don't be a DMB, a do nothing bitch. It's like there's a lot of do nothing bitches out there that are just doing nothing. Don't be a do nothing bitch. Get off the couch and do something. Whatever it may be, I guarantee you, if you go out there and do something, you'll be doing a lot more of something else too eventually. Yeah! Don't be a do nothing bitch. Get out there and be successful. You gotta be successful. Only way you can be successful is working harder than everybody else. You know what? <laughs> I gotta take the wheel out before it's gone. Get out of here. 2021. Bolt goes through, bolts into the fender instead of a nut and bolt combination, which is just a little more of a pain in the ass. It's like they made all of these fucking revolutionary fucking design changes that should have been done 20 fucking years ago. This is shit that's like any mechanic that's ever worked on a motorcycle thought about this 20 years ago, but Harley's just now doing it. Oh, just look at, look at that. They don't, so the old ones all flare out on the bottom like this, so they don't fit through the fender. You either gotta squeeze the fucking shit out of them or take them out backwards. New shit, flare's gone. Finally. Maybe they promoted a fucking mechanic to engineer instead of hiring some fucking college dildo that's never rode a bike in his life to design motorcycles. All right, first thing's off. The fender's off. Sell that one over to Mike Smith. See if he wants to the bike. A good fender's got for 10 or 7 more years left. Like wow, look at this. Look at this fucking cable holder. It's a fucking nice piece right there. I don't know why it needs to have a barcode. That looks like shit, but fuck, dude. I kind of want to make some of those. I want to buy a 3D printer and make Cruz Originals cable holders and <laughs> just rip that shit right off. 
What's up guys? Ryan Cruzy from Cruzy Originals. Quick, just throw this in your face. This is our dress up kit right here. Air cleaner covers in all kinds of colors. It's all powder coat, it's not anodized, it's not gonna fade, it's not gonna turn weird colors, stuff like that. CNC built aluminum. We got the KO design, the stunt bunny and all that. We've also got matching derby or points covers. We also make these for the M8 and all twin cam models. We've got derby covers for all twin cam models and bagger and soft tail coming soon. Also our slider derby covers. They actually have this cut into them now. This is our first generation right here. All available on Cruise Originals, cruiseoriginals.com. Hit us up. You know where it's at. fuse kills the power to generally everything on the bike I need to remove this guy right here so I'm going to turn it to accessory put the key in it there's a little tab underneath here push up with your finger and you can turn the key backwards it unlocks it this guy comes off and you unscrew that shit off there I'm not going to reuse that I'm going to lose that I'm going to just key fob this thing like a CBO I hate key fobs, but it is what it is with the new shit, I guess. Geezer Glide trees, uh, 49 millimeter, which it's already 49 millimeter front end, but basically the stock trees look like shit, and I want the trees to be exposed. These trees look badass. These trees are very affordable. These trees take some rake and trail out of it as well, which makes the bike handle better. Uh, you can run the lines like your clutch and brake line down through the trees. They're really, really nice. They come with all the shit you need. I also got some titanium riser bushings, because why not, I guess? Never know when you're gonna need some titanium riser bushings to be that hardcore. Man, I guess I'm gonna throw it together. Oh, that fits in there really, really nice. Ooh, do I have risers here? Am I jumping the gun? I fucking sure do. They're in the showroom. Definitely a press fit. 
talking most definitely. It's called the finger blaster right there. hoping they fit. Look at how beautiful this is. Damn, that's nice. Torque on a titanium bolt is fucking intense compared to a regular bolt. They don't stretch. Torque on a bolt is just how much torque is how far they can stretch before they give up basically. This thing's already greased, I'm just adding a little more to it because I'm in there so why not. Shit's gonna be dope. This is this is this shit. Rolling burnouts fingertips. Drifts fingertips. It's feedback is unreal. It is amazing. This shit is gonna look hard as a motherfucker on an M8 bagger right now. cartridges these are for a dyna but the spring rate is the same on the dyna as it is on the bagger uh, they're basically the same these are just longer and these have a longer stroke so woo, we got a lot more travel in these than we do in the bagger version because the bagger version is two and some change inches shorter uh, it's a little better a little better setup and it's also a lot taller so we're gonna slide the tubes up a little bit which I'm kind of a fan of that look anyways and I'm gonna start building these with some Lowrider S legs off of 2017. Lowrider S. I made these chips. We're gonna speed through this a little bit, but uh, we got Pro One Gold Tubes available on the website. Lowrider S, twin cam Lowrider S fork legs. Bolts right up to everything except for the fender. You gotta run, uh, we got a Dyna Fat Bob fender coming. Axio Legend Suspension Axio 49 millimeter Dyna front end right here stock height stock height Dyna It's like three inches over a bagger naturally already And we're gonna put all this shit together It's all available on the website. I'm gonna burn through this really quick and then we're gonna kind of Get back to filming when I can start putting the front end back together You guys if you want to watch like how this goes down You can go back to how to build a bagger on a budget project that guy back there and check out that series It's in our playlist and you can watching me assemble this shit over and over again and over again. I 
it's any thicker anymore. Oh, look at those, the exact same kind. Here, scotch bite the f out of those, make them look real nice. Let's fucking work for daddy. No, that ain't gonna work for, that ain't gonna work for fucking nobody. Fucking dirty old crazy fucking whore. Dill dialed, man. Dill dialed. Had to make a spacer. Here's what it is. Not the prettiest looking spacers, but. Eh. Maybe I powder coat them down the road. All right, so this is kind of closing for the day. It's been a long day. We knocked out a lot of shit. Let's just walk with me a little bit. So we did the front end. Handlebars are mostly mocked up. Uh, I gotta get different grips because I want to run heated grips. So we're waiting on that. We got the RCS, I can never remember that. Brembo, this is mocked up. I'm gonna have to make a master cylinder mount. That's kind of, this is really getting in the way and causing a lot of problems for that type of shit, which I might do it off the risers down here or something like that. The trees are in. I still got to torque the trees, set the neck, all that shit, but I'm going to take the bike down to do that. The front end is all set up with the Legends cartridges, the Axio cartridges, uh, Pro 1 tubes, Low Rider S legs. That is all done. We got a fender on the way still. Brakes are all torqued down. Still got to run the brake lines, all that stuff. Uh, I need a clutch lever. Where's the clutch lever at? Did not get ordered? Yeah, I got it ordered. One finger one? One actual one finger length, the shortest one? Yeah. All right. Uh, mirror mount and a mirror mount. I need a mirror mount for this side somehow because this thing got no mount. I want to have mirrors. I got some fancy Arlen Nessers. Uh, I got a seat on here just to mock it up because when I had the stock seat on the bars on, I it, I was very disappointed. It was very uncomfortable. So we threw Shadrack seat on, made a world of difference. I'm gonna put the Legends on tonight. We're not gonna film that. We're running out of time on the old SIM card right there, but we'll get back to it. I'm just gonna mock them up because I still gotta figure out how I'm gonna mount the reservoirs and do that kind of shit. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. Uh, went fast. Got a lot done today. I'm stoked. This is going to be one, one bad bitch right here. So, coming soon, like I said, I'm going to put these on next. I got the top mounts for them to mount them up. You know, the reservoir's old big dick swinging on top, which is what I want to do. But I'm also putting a sissy bar on it because I do not, I want my old lady to go for rides with me and I don't want her hanging on my back. I want her to be able to have a sissy bar. I've never had that before. It sucks when they're hanging off your back. And it would be more comfortable for her and maybe she'd be more apt to ride with me. I love you, honey. You're such a beautiful woman. Uh, so, on that note, like, subscribe, ring that bell, tell everybody about us. We're having a good time here. And next time, on Cruzy Originals, we'll install this high performance Legend Suspension Axio Remote Reservoir Performance Harley Davidson Suspension on this goddamn Harley Davidson over here. <laughs> yeah, check us out. Cruzy Originals on Instagram, cruzyoriginals.com, Cruzy Originals on your mom. What?